Justin Bieber in Kodak Black sued over shooting at Super Bowl 56 weekend after party last year, 2022. Justin Bieber and Kodak Black are being sued over a shooting that occurred after Justin's concert after party during last year's Super Bowl weekend. Two guys are suing Justin Bieber and rapper Kodak Black after they say they were shot at the singer's Super Bowl after party last year. Mark Schaefer and Adam Rahman claim in the lawsuit that they were shot and suffered serious injuries during the February 2022 incident outside the Nice Guy in Los Angeles. The venue, Kodak, and Justin are being blamed by the two males. Kodak was one of three people that were shot outside the gathering. According to Kodak's agent, while he was leaving the venue, a member of his crew was jumped by an unknown attacker, and the rapper leapt into the fray to save his friend before shots were fired. The victims contend in the lawsuit that Kodak was the shooting's main impetus, attempting to inflame the conflict and injure the opposing side. In addition, the victims allege that venue security was lacking, putting some blame on the musicians and promoters. Kodak Black, Justin Bieber, The Nice Guy, The Hwood Group, Revolve Group, The Cities of Los Angeles, West Hollywood, and Los Angeles County were singled out by the victims as being responsible for the harm. Rahman and Schaefer are represented by Gloria Allred. Bradford Cohen, Kodak's lawyer, claims, I have seen a lot of poor allegations in my day. In 26 years, this is the worst complaint I have ever seen. I anticipate Kodak's lawsuit being dropped pretty soon. Cohen says, there is minimal detail in the complaint, and Ms. Allred puts the defendants together rather than making particular charges against each. It's Law Study 101. I feel bad for Ms. Allred since she put her name on the complaint. Do you find it overwhelming why this problem just came up now? In order to keep up with the most recent news, you might want to ring the bell and subscribe to our channel. Many thanks for stopping by, stay American.